<laughs> All right, well, mum of three, Megan Healy, faces daily challenges that most of us can't even begin to imagine. She's one of 23,000 Australians affected by multiple sclerosis. But she's about to prove that her disability won't get in the way of an epic challenge. She leaves this morning from Melbourne, bound for Sydney on... Yes, you're looking at what she's going to be driving. It is a lawnmower. And I'm pleased to say that she joins us now with husband Ryan and children Sydney, Leilani and Finlay. Good morning to all of you. Good, Good morning, guys. Lisa. Megan, I'll, I will start with you. You are riding a lawnmower from Melbourne to Sydney. That is very gutsy. Tell us why you're doing this. <laughs> I'm doing it to raise awareness and money for MS and I'm also doing it, my children are um, young carers, so I'm doing it to highlight the fact that there are children out there that have no choice but to look after their parents or their grandparents or their siblings that um, have disabilities. What, what great kids you've got. Do you have a support crew going with you on the trip? It's a heck of a long way. I do. I have um, ten people going with me, so it'll be a lot of fun. How quickly does a lawnmower go, I have to ask? Because I'm, I'm trying to work out how long the trip will take. It only goes 20 kilometres an hour. So it's going to take us 16 days, ending in Westmead Hospital on the 29th of May, which is World MS Day. Wow. That's, um, that's quite an effort, as I said. Brian, you are married to an amazing woman. She is amazing. <laughs> uh, very inspirational each day, you know. We wake up and we think we're doing it tough, but to um, get into Megan's shoes and she wakes up every day, never complains, um, and just gets on with it. So, were very you, proud of her. Were you surprised that she set herself such a tough challenge? No, not at all. Um, years before, when we used to run around playing sport, and um, she never got stopped back then. And, and now um, she won't get stopped here. She'll get the message out and across. And, um, and my three kids, they're right behind her also every day. So I'm it's, sure it's they are. It's going to be sensational. I'm, I'm pretty sure that they can hear us. Leilani, can you hear me? Yeah. Tell me, yesterday was Mother's Day. How proud are you of your mum, Leilani? Very proud. I bet you are. And I'm sure um, you, you... Sorry, go on. <laughs> I'm sure that uh, you're incredibly proud of her and uh, it's, it's quite the challenge that you've set yourself, Megan. How can people actually donate and support you? Well, we've got a Facebook page and there's a link on there that people can click on and donate at my Kiss Goodbye to MS page because it's Kiss Goodbye to MS month, so I'm doing it to, um, to key in with Kiss Goodbye to MS. But it's really funny, I don't think this is such a big thing because I'm a bit of a country girl and I'm used to riding a lawnmower, so... <laughs> and I gather I'm that's... at home on a lawnmower. And that's one of the few household chores that you can still do, is that right? Yeah, that's pretty much the only household chore I can still do. So it's quite important to me to still be able to get on a mower and, and ride it. So, you know, what, what, what's a bit longer ride? <laughs> yeah, are you going blades down or blades up? <laughs> No, going blades up, unfortunately. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We can't sorry. raise any money by mowing any lawns. But... <laughs> there can be a, a few bumps on that highway, so that's probably a good decision. Well, we, Megan, we wish you all the very best, and, and to Brian and Sydney, Leilani and Finlay. You're an amazing family, and uh, we'll be with you every step of the way. Yeah, yeah.